Hey guys, it's Hightower and Axial Matt here. Hey guys, yeah. Yeah, and this <laughs> week for Indie Night, we're looking at Antichamber. Antichamber. Which is... is that a, what the fuck is that? <laughs> so, Antichamber is this really weird game. You may have heard of it. It's been popping up in a lot of press, but it's like a sort of... It's kind of a puzzle game, I guess. Kind of. Like, it's on PC. This is the first thing I should say. This is, um, I got, I'm playing okay. this on Steam. I'm not, I don't think it's on Xbox Marketplace, but... Yeah, dude, that... That looks really fucking weird so far. Like, yeah, so I, I've sped this up, but I'm going to point this out, is that this game has a really weird way. Like, So you get these weird inspirational messages, and there's this <laughs> staircase, and if I keep going down red, I just keep getting the exact same space. Look, so there's that, and then I go down. Well, I mean, you hate to go down the dirty staircase, right? I'm here again. So if I go upstairs... Oh, it's up. Suddenly, oh. there's something on the left. The these stairs are there. just kind of one example. There's there's nothing to you actually get from going up these stairs. It's just kind of a... Sort of demonstration of how this game works. I'm confused by everything that is happening. So right it's now. like you're supposed to progress through it. You get like a sort of thing at one point that lets you point, put put blocks around. But this is like an example uh -huh. of this game and how weird it is. It has these whole four dimensional. <laughs> what the fuck? Like, but it gets Whoa. better once I stumble across it. There is a really awesome little dude thing. There's like a doorway in here. Like you say, like these are all like museum pieces. But then suddenly here, there's a I was doorway. Say, like, one, one of those things look like a Pokemon or something. Now you yeah. You went through you see the... this? I'm in another what? room, and then I go around, and there's nothing there. Dude, that's just like that. That's some straight up like what's what's that painting where there's like a billion staircases and just some doors or whatever? Yeah, you, this, yeah that's this some of that game just really there. fucks with you. It's really God. weird design, but it's awesome at the same time. So this is another really interesting bit. If I keep running around here, <laughs> suddenly if I keep looking, the arrows have disappeared and the way out has disappeared. But there's a message. The dog. We said some. Yeah, you didn't see that. It said some choices leave us running in circles. Ah. Look, I, I run around and there it is again. Have you noticed anything different yet? I wonder, like, how many like people have just gone batshit insane trying to play this. Yeah, like, just like, look, oh, suddenly I'm back here, that, and up in that direction is that little 4D room I was just in. Dude, I, this this is definitely like one of those games where it's just the entire purpose is for the developer to see how much they can fuck with you, right? It, like, it it's a real it really screws with you some of the stuff it does it can it can do. So like, like I have to go through this door, I have to look there and go backwards, and then it shuts. Oh, that's that's pretty cool. That's like, that's a nifty little puzzle. I, I can see that one. I, like, all the I like all the little inspirational yeah. things start out with like yeah. some weird as hell picture. It's this is a really interesting <laughs> bit. Look, so you can see there's this door here. Look, if I look, there's nothing yeah. there. It's just Whoa. a red room. But if I press right against this. You can see through it. And it just... changes. Oh, that's cool. Like it does. That's it uses that quite a few times. Look, if I look back, and suddenly it's red again, and so it's it's like you go through a whole other dimension just through the colors. Yeah, it, like it, there's there's no like delay or anything. It just cuts. It just changes like that without that stressing the computer. It, some fucking crazy shit. This game just screws with you in so many ways. It's unbelievable. That's like but, if I made a video game and you just constantly am trying to fuck with you. <laughs> you just try to recreate it in Minecraft or something. Oh my god. Don't <laughs> <me>. <laughs> so yeah, that's Antichamber. It's available on Steam at the moment. I'm not sure where else it might be available. It's 15 quid, so whatever that is in American money. Have fun I'd, playing with your squids. I did. <laughs> totally worth it. So yeah. That's Antichamber on Steam, and head to AchievementHunter.com for more videos. Later, guys! <laughs> Leave that noise in. <laughs> <laughs>